Welcome back to Childhood Thoughts. I'm the narrator. Yes, like I always do. I like to talk about certain scenes from <clears throat> movies. You know, it could be anything. A lot of times I really like talking about movies, uh, you know, autumn related or, you know, has that spooky feel. And this is the one that got to me. And it is Halloween 2. The director's cut. Where they kill off Laurie Strode. And there's this really good rendition of Love Hurts by Nazareth. Um, depends on Nazareth or, or uh, Ella Everly Brothers. Depends on... Your your type of mood, I guess, but um, it goes where she you don't know if she's in heaven. You don't know. It, it's basically in the commentary. Like Rob Zombie said, like it, it all. It's up all up to you. Like what you know where she is. Like kind of what they did with Brady versus Jason at the end, where. When um, Jason rises up with Freddy's head, you don't know if he's in heaven. You don't know if he's if it's you know um, the next day or if it's in some other you know some you know other type of world. It's all up to you, and uh, you know I, I like that. So you don't even know what it is if this is heaven. If it's some sort of I don't know. Oh, you see a Sherry Moon coming in with a with a white horse, which we all know like, symbolizes something. Um, but what gets me the most is having her die. From you know, this has got to be one of those screw. It's probably the most WTF out of the series, and. I don't know. It because you have what happens with Danielle Harris's character. You have what happens to Malcolm McDowell, Loomis, of course, and just it, it, it just it gives you this. What just happened? <laughs> like I can just imagine someone going into this and. Just thinking, like, really, but it works. It works well. Like, it, it's it's up to. It's so ambiguous, and it's all up because of Scout. I think Scout was perfect. And I said this again. I said this before. Is how much I love Imogen as Amy. It's, um, I think. They also, they, they wanted Scout, and Scout was busy with um, the Runaways, I believe. So, like, um, they chose Imogen. And I think there's a few, others, few other names, but, um, you know, she is just so, such a, especially with this type, she is such a fucking chameleon that she could just play anything. And um, I'm going to get more into this character uh, within a few, you know, within episodes after. Uh, so, like, in between, uh, there will be some, you know, different one, different episodes. But I am going to talk more about uh, Scout Taylor Compton's version of Laurie Strode very soon. People are probably going to ask me, why are you going to do Jamie Lee? Dude, there's so many you could... You know, this version is so overlooked, and it'd be really fun to do a few, uh, you know, do a few videos, because I just think Scout just did it wonderfully, like she always does, in my opinion.